Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to Trending Reviews. So with everyone doing a lot of remote working nowadays, given the current climate, a lot of people are taking business meetings in their offices at home. So I've received this new product today. It's the Anchor PowerConf Bluetooth and USB speakerphone. So if you hold a lot of business meetings, you want to have the best quality calls, especially if there's a group of you and you want to gather around and take meetings remotely, then this is a perfect device for you. So today I'm gonna to give you an unboxing of the features that come with this and show you a little bit about the design, cover a bit of the specs and give you an audio review of how this sounds as well. Now the one thing I really like about this is that it's USB-C and it's got a very long, huge battery life and it's got a massive 24 hours of talk time. I've used a lot of speaker phones in the past, specifically like the Jabra ones, and they have about 10 to 15 hours of uh, talk time, but this one lasts very long, it charges very quick, and it's just got some really cool, simple, straightforward capabilities with excellent audio quality. But the one thing I really like about it is that it's very slim, it's easy to take with you anywhere, and it's perfect for remote working. So I'm gonna cover everything you need to know about this, so let's just get straight into it. Alright guys, so let's have a look. So this is the box that it comes with. A quick highlight of all of the main different specifications on this. Now it comes with six different mics for superior voice pickup, so that gives you a 360 degree voice coverage. Now it does have a five meter range, but that is way more than enough. And if you're in a small meeting room or a boardroom, that's plenty of range. Now it comes with a DSP ambient noise reduction as well. So that gives you very clear audio coming through and it has smart voice enhancement technology as well. Now what this means is that it gives you real time echo cancellation of up to 70 decibels and it reduces the background noise of up to 20 decibels as well. Now as I mentioned, it gives you 24 hours of talk time, which is amazing. It gives you an indicator light, which I'll show you when I turn it on. And you can also connect it to your computer or your phone as well through Bluetooth or by the provided USB cable and it's very lightweight and compact. So let's go ahead and open this up. There you go, a very nice design there. Now look how slim this is. A lot of these speakerphones are quite bulky and this one is just so lightweight, it's easy to carry. Before I open that, let's just see what else is in there. You've got a little thank you guide there. You also have a user guide and some instruction manuals there. So use a manual just to get up and running in multiple different languages. Let's put that there. You also have the box, which will have the USB cable in it. So here, as you can see, this is the USB-C cable. And you can also charge this using your USB port on your computer. If you have a separate USB-C charger, maybe for your laptop, then you can also use that to charge the actual device. Got a nice carry case there. Let's take a look inside. There we have a look at the design. Nothing else in the case, so I'll just leave it on the side. Now take a look at how slim this is. You've got nice rubber grip there as well to keep it solid on the desk. Then you also have a few buttons here. You have the uh, answer the phone call button. You have the microphone mute and uh, unmute button. The plus and minus are the volume controls. And then you also have a play button as well. Now you have this nice microphone design there around there. So you have a 360 degree field of audio coming through. On this end, you have a few ports. So you've got the traditional USB port there. You have the auxiliary out if you wanted to connect this maybe to a TV or a monitor and play back the audio from a external device. And you also have the USB-C power port there to charge the device. On the front side, you have two buttons. You have the Bluetooth button there to pair it and obviously the power button to turn the device on. So let me go ahead and turn this on. You just hold it down. There you have the indication. You got some lights there on the front. Now you have this blue indicator light there. It's flashing to show that it's now pairing so you can search for a device. So I have my MacBook and I'll be connecting it with this. Let me just bring that in. So it shows up as Anchor PowerConf and it is now connected. So before I make a phone call, I just wanna give you an idea of playing some music from my laptop on this device, just to show you how loud it can get and actually how clear the audio is. So I have a song loaded here, so let me go ahead and play this. You also have the volume buttons. 
this is the max. Now the touch sensitivity on these buttons are actually quite nice as well. I don't feel like I have to try a couple of times to get it to react and respond. So that's really cool there. Now the volume is actually pretty loud and I really like the punch in the audio there. It's not very high pitched and it doesn't have a lot of background noise or anything like that. It's just crystal clear. So I can actually play and pause using the play button here as well. So I have the song loaded on my laptop and if I just press the play button, it should pause it. There you go, about a second uh, delay there to pause the music, so if I go back and play it. Pretty convenient, it's very easy to do, so I think that is a very big win. Now what I'm going to do is use it for the main purpose, which is making phone calls. So I'm going to go ahead and make a phone call using my phone. So before I do that, I'm just going to connect the Bluetooth to my phone first. Okay, so let me go ahead and call one of my friends using my phone and get their opinion. Hello? Hey, can you hear me? Hi, yes, I can hear you. How is my um, audio coming out? Yeah, it's quite clear actually. Yeah, um, so I'm just calling you just because I got this new speakerphone and I was just testing the audio on this as well to see if it's um, quite clear um, as if I'm still using my phone. So what do you reckon? Yeah, it seems like it's, it's like you're using your actual phone, to be honest. Okay, I'm just going to adjust the volume and check to see if uh, it makes a difference. So, um, what are you up to today? Nothing much, doing a bit of uh, shopping. Okay, cool. Um, I'm just going to test one button, if you give me a second. Sure. Now, I've just hit the mute button there, so as you can see, this is just lit up red and it's they can't hear me on the other end of the call. Now if I continue. Uh, I just want to test one thing. I'm gonna step back about two meters and if you can let me know if you can still hear me, that'd be great, all right? Okay. Okay, I'm about two meters away. Can you still hear me quite clearly? Yeah, I can hear you quite clearly. It's only slightly quieter, but it's still very clear. Okay, and there's no like distortion or echo that you can hear in the background? No, it seems very clear. Okay, cool, because um, I can hear some cars out of the window, but can you hear that as well? No, I can only hear your voice. Okay, cool, that's pretty clear then. Um, let me just come back here, and I will try to hang up using the speakerphone as well, so uh, if that works, then um, I'll speak to you later. Okay, have a nice day. Okay. And there we go guys, so as you saw, pretty cool clear audio quality there. And I moved around a little bit further back and it was still uh, crystal clear to my friend there on the phone. So for me, this is the perfect device to take for meetings with you. Even if you wanted to go to the park and have a meeting outdoors, given the current climate, then I think you would get a very good job done there as well, making some really crystal clear phone calls and reducing a lot of the background ambient noise there as well. So for me, that is a big win. All right, so thanks for watching guys. I hope that was useful for you. If there's any questions you have about this speakerphone, then do drop a comment below. Otherwise, I'll leave a link on where you can purchase this on Amazon. It does come under just under $130, but for that price and the capabilities that you get, it's probably one of the best speakerphones I have, and it's in the 21st century now. A lot of them don't use USB-C to charge, so this one is perfect for that. And if there's anything else you'd like to know, then uh, let me know. Otherwise, I hope you subscribe. I hope you like this video, and I'll catch you guys at the next one. Take care.